Hello again everyone, Deflect here for Urban Fair Gaming. Want to bring you a video on two of the add-ons you can use in World of Warcraft. One is Raider IO, and you can simply go to the Raider IO website and see your characters. It's a great way to see your progression in Mythic Plus Dungeons. Uh, it, it does get a little bit of a bad rap because people sit there and they will use it for Raider IO score and people won't take anyone less than a certain IO score. You know, if you're less than 2,000, they might not take you to this dungeon or that dungeon. So it does get a bit of a bad rap, but it is very useful. Um, and just seeing your progression, seeing what keys you've timed, seeing how uh, things are progressing. And it does help your alts as well because you can link your main character and say your main character's 2,400, 2,800, 3,000, whatever it is. Uh, you can link it and then people can see that, you know, your main character is x so you have done the dungeons you do know the mechanics and that your alt might be like this is a low level alt i have at uh, 1300 so you can see that i've done you know 1300 on this character and you can see if people what they've done the dungeon on which is helpful so if i go into like say this one you can see i'm not a great healer i don't heal very often on this character so if i apply for a 16 key as a healer, I might not get accepted because I don't heal much and I might not have the competence to heal a 16. So it does help out when you're pugging groups because, you know, some people will apply, they might have a high Raider IO score, but then you might look at them and they might be applying for a healing role and it might be 153 as a healer. I've done one dungeon as a healer. It was actually a 10. I don't really heal a lot. Um, but uh, yeah, that's it's very useful in that aspect, even if someone knows mechanics and have completed the dungeon, because if they completed it, odds are they know the mechanics by now. So you can actually see if you two chested it, one chested it, if you didn't time it, if you timed it, what level the key was, what your highest is on Tyrannical and Fortified. So a lot of useful information comes from this. And then if you're on the uh, Raider IO site, you can always click on their main and see what their main has done as it says alt of, but you have to link your main and all that. Not very hard to do and it's very easy with you just, like, just to go in and do it. Uh, everything you'll need to know is up here. You just go to your profile and click on your profile. But I wanted to go into the other uh, add-on that you can use and that's Warcraft Logs. And I like Logs because it shows what I can do better. So it's a way to improve yourself. Like, uh, for instance, if you're sitting here and I'll just go to a mythic dungeon and what's a great dungeon? Everyone loves the chronic wake. So the last wake I did was a 15. You can click on and you can see how you did uh, take some things with granted key percentage is always jacked up because it doesn't matter your item level for this. It's not like looking at the raid. The raid one is item level specific. This is not. This just shows you your item level, and then this shows a key percentage, what you did for the key percentage. So you could get, you know, in a 15, you could have a couple big people, especially at the end of seasons coming in, where they're, you know, max level gear and crushing 15s for their uh, weekly vault and, you know, just, you know, cr getting crazy DPS versus the beginning of the season where everyone's at the same gear level to start and you can see your item level that kind of has a little bit more play there anyways uh the useful information is you can see you know i didn't parse great but i was you know i'm pretty low on the item level for this one uh but you can see your cast so you can see how many casts per minute you're getting and then by your class you can see how active you are it's 75 percent uh, and, and then i use a lot for deaths to see because there's always something i can do better on my deaths uh, and that is what I usually check it out because I tank a lot more than I DPS right now. And the deaths is very important for me when tanking. Because you can go in and you can see what abilities and what happened. And then I can prepare for next time. Knowing that, you know, Gore Splatter just crushed me for a whole bunch. Brain Fluids hit me. And, you know, because I am low item level doing a 15, it uh, hits pretty hard and takes a lot of my uh, health away. But you can see that the healer was you were pumping some heels and it just uh we just pulled the whole second floor and i couldn't survive anyway uh, i am again low uh low health so uh it does happen sometimes there's nothing more you can do and sometimes there is and that way you can progress and learn on uh different things you can do differently you know you can check out the threat you can check out your buffs you can see if the interrupts are happening 
a uh, lot of different things you can do with warcraft logs and you can see all the kicks that are happening you can also break it down between packs so if you know you guys are struggling with a pack you can go to the specific pack you can go to the boss and see what kind of what was happening with the boss you can actually watch it as well um now this one's old but you can you know go to the replay and you can watch what happens in the replay so you can see the first pull when you start to come in actually i'll go to the one before so now you can see all the mobs coming in and you can see uh where the threat is what they're attacking what they're doing where the explosives are this is explosive week so it's really hard to kick everything with a whole bunch of melee and try and get uh get all the explosives so uh definitely uh definitely fun to watch and learn from so it is a great tool to use uh to get there and really find out what you can improve upon in your game a uh, great improval tool so i would definitely recommend both these uh raider io and warcraft logs uh it just helps you out um and it helps grow your mythic plus game if you have any questions leave a comment below like share subscribe this was dflag firm and fair gaming we'll see you in the next video